Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Scorpio, June 24, 2022. Venus heads into your solar 8th house today, and you're in good shape for bonding with someone, or yourself, more deeply. This transit is great for working on the more complicated or intricate areas of relationships, sharing, and intimacy. It's not the most straightforward transit for outward expressions of love and affection. However, approaching the trickier gray areas of life with more grace, charm, and understanding can help boost you in critical ways. It's also a fine period for finding support or backing from others, emotional and financial. Today, you're more passionate about your work, daily routines, approach, or methods. Productivity increases when you're enjoying what you are doing. Today's last quarter moon in Pisces will bring forth the opportunity to release and surrender emotional themes surrounding everything from your heart's desires to your romantic longings, but there's more. In addition to the moon entering Aries and your busy sixth house of daily rituals, the sun will be making its debut in your sister sign, Cancer, all the while energizing your ninth house of expansion, opportunity, and unknown territory. Are you ready to take a leap of faith in the name of love? Lady Venus is, after all, harmonizing with your modern ruler, Pluto, so spicy pow wow and romantic intensity is almost inevitable. Go where you feel like you will be cared for. Now that the sun is in watery cancer and trying to your sign, you should listen to your gut feelings when you are making decisions to advance in your professional path. You might feel called to study or work with a prominent professional mentor who could help you hone the skills needed to progress in your career path. Travel could even be on the table throughout cancer season, especially if you have to take a work trip or are exploring your options in new cities. Keep an open mind. Forces beyond your control might interfere with attainment of your financial goals at this time. This doesn't mean that you'll never attain them only that today it's probably going to be delayed. You might not be able to reach some of the people who can help you, and there might be information you need which you don't have right now. Hang in there it should all come together tomorrow. Your encounters run smoothly and amicably, like a peaceful flowing river. Family and friends would love to ride this wave with you. You now have the opportunity to resolve old conflicts and hurts and to move forward united. If you are smart about it, you will strengthen ties to your loved ones. If you think something's too good to be true right now, odds are it is. If not, you're not paying close enough attention. Take another look. Your enthusiasm reveals your zest for life and your passion feels like second nature to you. Pursuing dreams you believe in you're able to approach anyone you're interested in, give them an invitation or unmistakable encouragement. It's important not to let this opportunity pass, make the most of any situation. Take care of yourself and your needs. There is a great advantage in making sure your emotions are cared for and stable before you go around trying to heal others. Your feelings are powerful and erratic today, and you might find that other people are trying to oppose your beliefs. Stand up for yourself and be strong. Don't wait until the last minute before telling someone exactly how you feel about the situation. You might notice a strong romantic pull on this day. Feeling a need to connect with others, especially those you are closest to, is a common effect of this vibration. Chances are it has been some time since you've enjoyed an evening of romance and intimacy, given your tendency to work hard. Take the time to make arrangements for this kind of enjoyment. Make a date. This kind of exchange will do your heart a world of good. A day after Venus left your relationship sector, the moon has returned with a chance to become more emotionally engaged and connected, including with the desires and expectations the planet of love has left you with. Venus has already swapped her planet of love for her planet of money hat as she spends her first full day with Mercury and his smart head for money in your financial sector. This is giving you the best of both worlds, at a time when you are also getting a better sense of what you are fighting for on the job front. A day after Venus left your relationship sector, the moon is here, following in the planet of love's footsteps in order to capture and amplify the desires and expectations she left you with. Strong emotional responses can confirm what your heart has been telling you, 
at a time when it is still more about establishing what you want from your relationships and what they need from you. Our eyes in the sky. We want to start connecting with others on a deep level, marking a time of improved interpersonal relationships. However, we might also want to rush relationships and emotions. Keep in mind that it's important to get to know people before diving into a committed partnership or becoming best friends. As long as you take your time getting to know others, the new moon can yield results all around. Being safe in the company of others is extremely important during this luminary. In typical Pisces fashion, use your intuition when telling fact from fantasy and reality from untruths. Trust your gut and make choices that coincide with your intuition. It can help you navigate through life. This is also a wonderful day to make conservative, not risky, investments to help elevate your bank account and assets to new heights. Also give your home and family some love today. Redecorate and spruce up your dwelling. Call your family and tell them how much you care about them now. Reach out and open your heart to others. Today, we welcome the vibrancy of a new season as we celebrate the summer solstice, and at the same time the sun moves into warm-hearted cancer. Now that the summer is getting into full swing, we can take full advantage of Cancer's excellent hosting abilities by throwing parties and summarizing our environments. After midnight, Venus in Taurus forms a trine to Pluto in Capricorn, intensifying romantic and financial situations. While difficult Venus-Pluto aspects might cause us to behave jealously, the trine shows us the value of digging deep and investigating what lies beneath surface-level interactions in ways that are ultimately transformative. A love affair that begins now would be one where each person negotiates their power dynamics through the vessel of the relationship, achieving healing in the process. We can use this influence to overcome sexual hang-ups and trust issues with our partners. On a material level, this can be a good time to invest in property or assets. They may come with hidden perks, yielding unexpected value over time. Shortly following this, the Sun exits cerebral Gemini to journey through emotional cancer in the month ahead. At this time, we become more aware of which relationships, business, or domestic factors allow us to feel safe in expressing our identity. To this end, we might be more attracted to that which reminds us of our past, which we view through a haze of nostalgia. We can pine for our childhoods or the way that things used to be. Our frame of reference is insular, making us more comfortable on our home turf, within established relationships or family dynamics. Our ego and our emotions are aligned, so we are less self-conscious about sharing our feelings. Yet, we still prefer to reveal ourselves to those who have earned our trust, as we know that not everyone is worthy of witnessing our vulnerability.